It's all perception. Perception is reality. As long as I'm helping people, that's all that matters. Being with the populace, that was my path. Do you need me? Do I need ya? We going? Scared? What's up, you guys? It's Woke Hill here. What's up? I'm Pablo. Um, I'm a member of Act Natural. Yeah. I'm blinded by the lights, feel like the weekend, shit. <laughs> I'm Faisus from Act Natural, and I love you. I'm Graham, I'm Graham Brighticus. Fuck. Shall we do that? Nah, man, keep it. I'm Graham Brighticus. What Act Natural means to me is a, is a group of guys getting together, doing dope shit, and just being themselves. And making original tunes. Um, Act Natural means everything. I feel like it's not something I really chose. It's something that chose me and chose all of us. Like, of course we have the free will to do what we want and be a part of this, but this is something greater than us. And it means a lot to us. So it's not slavery? No, it's not slavery. It's all perception. Perception is reality and I don't wanna, it's not slavery to me. As long as I'm helping people, that's all that matters. Um, Act Natural means, it means, um, it means... <laughs> Act Natural means a lot of things, like Act Natural, the name itself, you know, keep it natural. Um, and just, you know, fun, being able to do creative shit with our brothers, having a good time, and really proving to ourselves that like, shit, anything's possible, and we're gonna fucking take over all the TV screens in your house, and your mom's gonna... But also, yeah, shit, I love my brothers. These are all my brothers, you know what I'm saying? This is not some Craigslist ad, like, let me put a boy band together. No, this is like, shit, we, we've been known what's going on, you know what I'm saying? Who wrote these boofy ad questions? I'm sorry, I'm joking, it was a joke. It was a diversion, because that's a very deep question. Um, what does that natural mean to me? Um, it means a lot. <laughs> I, I wish I could, like, take a fucking device and just go, do, 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 do. And you, like I could translate. I can't really translate it into words, but shit. I mean, <laughs> what's the next question? Music that inspires me, honestly, is uh, anything, anything new and different um, that comes my way um, is is inspiring to me as well. Um, I do have uh, a couple of artists that also inspire me, but we can explore that later. Well, music inspires me. Um, I've said it before, just like, I'm a fan of greatness. So whatever people tend to gravitate towards, I'm not gonna say I'm a bandwagon, but there's certain shit I used to listen, or not listen to rather, because a lot of people listen to it, but now I'm just trying to appreciate good music for what it is, as opposed to being like, oh, that shit's mainstream or whatever. But lately it's been like Adele, Rihanna, uh, it's a whole lot of shit, and like, we can get into another time, like Kiel said, but yeah. I'd say the music that inspires me is like mainly early 2000s and like 2010-ish type of music, pop music. I don't know, I grew up listening to that shit. Kids Bop, what's up? That was my shit. Uh, the radio is still my shit. A lot of people hate the radio, I fuck with the radio, you know what I'm saying? So I'll go with, uh, I'll go with early 2000s music. That's, that's just shit that touch, that, that tickles my taint, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Tickles your what? My taint. Anything that's good, bro. Anything that's good, anything that's... I don't know what's even deemed as good. Honestly, there's some bad music. You ever heard a bad song that's just so weird that you're like... You know what I'm saying? Like, so... Graham Bright likes bad music? Is this what we're doing? Graham Bright... Likes bad music? Likes music. Alright. <laughs> I like music. I mean, what do I find myself listening to on a regular basis? Probably rap. Um... Um... Rap. Bro, this light is so fucking bright. Rap, pop, uh, I like my R&B too. If we can keep up our go hard work, I see us on tour doing some amazing dope shit. In one year, I have no clue because we can't tell the future, but definitely will be an evolved version of what we are now a way greater version because every year the trajectory only goes up. But um, yeah, hopefully traveling the world, visiting new places, 
definitely evolved. That's without a question. Um, well, where Act Natural is going to be in one year, hopefully, not hopefully, where we're gonna be in one year is, uh, shit, we're gonna have a number one song. We're gonna have done at least a United States tour and hopefully out of the country doing a tour because that would be dope as fuck. And um, yeah, I'm gonna kiss you. <laughs> in one year? Um, where do I see you act natural in one year? I don't know. I feel like that's up to God. That's up to God. Like, I don't even, I have aspirations for where we'd want to be, but shit, I mean, even that, I feel like that's dictating the future. I feel like I just got to work in the now and do everything I need to do now and do everything we need to do now. So then we, it's decided for us where we want to be. Like we could imagine something, it could be even better. It's all dependent on like what we do right now. Is that a fair answer? Is that a fair answer? Y'all fuck with that answer? GB for Prez? Is that it? <laughs> Gangnam Style! Gangnam Style. Oh, Tupper Chico too. This is some really good. Fizzy water. I like that one.